DJ here with Achieve Peak, and today we're going to be doing a cardio and core workout. So for this workout, we're going to be going through four different circuits. We're going to be alternating between cardio and abs. For our cardio circuits, we're going to do four exercises performed all in a row for two rounds. Our working time is 20 seconds. Our break time is 10 seconds. For the ab circuits, we're going to be doing four exercises performed all in a row for two rounds. Our working time will be 30 seconds. Our break time will be 15 seconds. In between the different circuits, we'll then take a 15 second extended break. If you like this workout, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and let's get to work. All right, we have about 20 seconds until we get started with our warm up. If you have a fitness tracking watch, be sure to start your workout now. Our first exercise we're going into for our warm up is body weight squats. So for this one, we're gonna have our feet just about shoulder width apart. And then from here, we're gonna drop down, come up, keeping that back nice and straight. All right, here we go. Let's just go at your own pace here. If you wanna start with some partial reps and then come back up, that's totally fine. If you wanna kinda of drop down and sit into that nice and deep, that's cool too. Here we go. Good controlled movements here. Our next exercise we're going into is leg swings on the left side. You may need like a wall or something to hold on to for these. Here we go. So for the leg swings, I'm gonna hold on to the wall here. I'm just gonna swing my leg back and forth like this, feeling everything stretch out. When I kick up, feeling it stretch in the hamstrings. Don't forget to breathe. Try to kick it back a little further, a little further higher, or further up in the front. The next move, we're just gonna switch sides here. Go to the right side. All right, switch sides. There we go. Feeling everything stretch out in the hips and legs. Try to kick it back a little. Make sure that when you're kicking it back, you're not kind of just leaning forward like that though. Next, we're going to be going into a trunk twist. There we go. All right, so for trunk twist, feet a little wider than shoulder width, and we're just turning here. Trying to turn at the core. Right here, we're not rotating and pivoting the feet while we're doing this. Good controlled movements as we get further into the working time. Try to turn a little further. There we go. Next, we're going to be going in to chest openers. All right, so pull back here, come across, stretch the back out, just like that. There we go. Go at your own pace. If you want to kind of get a little rotation right here up, kind of feel it in the shoulders a little more, that's great too. Bring them across. Next, we're going to be going into good morning. So we're going to kind of stretch out that lower back and more on the hamstrings here. So here we go. Good mornings. Come down and then bend to the lower back. You kind of grab your toes if you want. Come back up. There we go. Don't forget to breathe while we're doing this. There we go. We'll get one more. There we go. All right, we got about 20 seconds until we get started with the actual workout. Our first exercise we're going into is seal jacks. We're going to have our feet together, hands out in front, and then when we hop, our hands are going to go wide, come back. Low impact, you're right here, just like that. A couple seconds until we get started. All right, let's go. There we go. Remember, low impact right here. Don't forget to breathe. Go at your own pace, but try to push yourself. There we go. Next, we got lateral shuffle and touch. Make sure you have some room beside your start with our feet wide, together, apart, tap, reverse. Low impact, you're just not hopping. 
There we go. Bam, bam. When we bend, we're bending at the hips and the knees, not at the lower back. Low impact, you can still go quick without hopping. It's not low intensity, it's low impact. Here we go. All right, next one in to faux jump rope, right here. It's like we're jump roping, we're just doing a rope. Low impact, do single leg calf raises, try to get those hands in the air too. There we go. Don't forget to breathe. Power through the calves. Try not to let the heels hit the ground. There we go. If you want any kind of bounce on the left, bounce on the right. All right, next, we got reverse lunge with tap. So, bending at the hips and knees, kicking the foot back, tapping the foot that's up front still. Here we go. So, bam, bam. We're not really putting weight on that foot that's going back when we're doing this. Like I could pretty much just kind of kick back if I wanted. <sighs> Try to keep that back nice and straight. <sighs> Here we go, going back into it. Seal jacks. Getting that heart rate up. Starting to feel a little sweat coming on. Here we go. Let's go. Maybe try to speed it up just a little bit here. There we go. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Alright. Lateral shuffle and touch. Start with our feet wide. Hop, bring them together. Here we go. So together, apart, tap. Together, apart, tap. There we go. Bending at the hips and knees, not at the lower back. There we go, come on. Push yourself. All right, back into four jump ropes. Let's go. When you're doing this, Make sure to engage the core. Here we go. Come on. All right. Reverse lunge with tap. <clears throat> After this, we're going into abs. So we're dropping down onto the ground. You may need a mat. Here we go. Boom. Boom. Come on. Let's go. Keep pushing. Try to stay nice and low. There we go. We got a short little break here. Then we're going in to crunches. So we're going to be down here on our back. Right here. If you want, you can leave your feet on the ground or have them up. Either is fine. Hands behind the head, coming up, back down. Every time you come up, squeeze the core. Exhale when you're right here. Feel that added little contraction in the abs. Here we go. Make sure you're not using your arms to pull your head so you don't strain your neck. You can put your feet down, that's totally fine. Here we go. Next we're going in to reverse crunches. So here what I like to do is put my hands up under my butt, feet out, bring them in, squeeze, come back. Here we go. Feet out, come up, squeeze, back down. Again, when your knees come up, you exhale. Squeeze. If this is too difficult, the modification is going to be from here, come here, boom. Just like that. If you need to take a break, rest for a second, get back into it. There we go. Alright, next we're going to a side plank reach through. So, I'm going to be on my left arm here, working this left side from here, we're going to come up. 
reach through, come back. Here we go. So start here, come through, reach back behind you, come back. If that's too tough, another option is just to do it on the knees like that. Just like that. Don't forget to breathe. Keep the core engaged the entire time. There we go. Come on, keep pushing. There we go. Switching sides. Side plank, reach through, right side. Try to see how far you can reach back. Here we go. Keep the core engaged. Try not to let your hips droop. Come on. Keep pushing. You got this. Let's go. Here we go. Right, we're going back in the crunches for round two. So we're going back again. My mat's a little small here. <laughs> Hands behind the head. Here we go, come up, squeeze, exhale. Come back down. Remember you can have your feet planted or you can pull them up. Either one's totally fine. Really working that upper core here. Every time you come up, try to get those shoulder blades off the ground. There we go. All right, reverse crunches. Ooh, sorry, sweat now. Hands up under the butt, feet out. There we go. I'm in up and down. Exhale when you bring the knees up. Here we go. Come on. Couple reps left. Doing great. One more. All right. Side plank, reach through. Left side. We got about five seconds till we get started here. Alright, let's do this. Oh. Feel those obliques catch fire right down here. Woo! Let's go. Keep pushing. seconds till we get started. Let's go. Reach through. Come on. You gotta embrace that burn on that day. Oh yeah. Good control movements. See how far you can reach back. Oh yeah. Last one here. There we go. All right, 15 seconds. We're going back in to cardio. We're gonna start with half jacks. Get some water if you need it. Yes, please. All right, so half jacks, hands by the side. Right here, come on. Oh, oh, low impact. Right here. Come on. Try to speed up a little. Get that heart rate just a little higher. Come on. See how fast you can go. All right, next, we got skip hops. So it's like we're skipping, but we're doing it 
in place. Ooh, you can feel in the core a little bit. Low impact, you get in the march coming up though. Here we go. Oh. If you're doing low impact, try to get that calf raise in when you're doing it. As you come up, get that calf raise, drive that knee up. You're just not coming off the ground. Come on. Breathe. There we go. And we got punch outs next. Nice wide feet. Getting that little movement going on with the legs, driving to the legs. We're just gonna throw a flurry of punches here. Here we go. Come on. Push it out. Don't forget to breathe. Let's go. Here we go. All right, next, we got lateral hops. We're just hopping side to side right here. Here we go. Lay it back. You're just kind of pushing the foot back right behind you like that. Come on. Don't forget to breathe. Let's go. Ah, there we go. Going back into half jacks. <clears throat> All right. Here we go. Come on. Keep pushing. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Faster. Let's go faster. Come on. Come on. Pick it up. Oh, great stuff right there. Skip hops. Here we go. Come on. Try not to let those heels hit the ground. We're getting our calf workout in today. Also, don't have your arms just dangling by the side. We don't have gumby arms. No noodle arms around here. Good controlled movements. We're athletes. Come on. Punch outs. Here we go. Couple seconds. Let's go. Come on, punch it out. You're a machine. Let's go. Keep pushing. Here we go. Lateral hops. After this, back into cardio. Couple seconds. <clears throat> or a couple. Back, back into abs, not cardio. We're in the cardio. Let's go. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Tighten the abs. Don't let the heels hit the ground. Let's go. Ah, there we go. Alright, we're going in to V leg lifts right here. So we're going to be down on our back. <clears throat> Hands up under the butt again. And then this time what we're going to do is from here, we're going to come up to the side, back down, up to the other side, making that V. Here we go. This is a little too difficult for you. Come down, drop, take a little break. Come back up, drop, take a little break. There we go. If you don't want to have your hands in there, that's totally fine. Put them out to the side. There we go. All right, next we got levitation crunches. So we're going to pull our feet up, right here, hands behind the head. And then what we're going to do is when we come up, we're just going to try to face straight up and kind of go straight up like that. We're not coming and curling in. Like with crunches. So straight up, come back down. Get the shoulder blades off the ground, come back down. Exhale on the way up, squeeze. Come back down. And then you go try to get a little one count hold. Come on, 10 seconds. Here we go. All right. Next, we got bicycle crunches. So hands behind the head, 
And then we're going alternating opposite knee to elbow. Just like that. Go at your own pace here. There we go, hands behind the head. You don't have to go blazing fast like that. Nice, slow and controlled. That's where you're gonna get the best burn. Try to keep those shoulder blades off the ground. Woo! Come on. Focus on the core. There we go. All right, next, we're gonna flip over here in the plank position. What we're gonna do is single side knee to elbow. So right here, bam, bam, just like that. At 10 seconds, or 15 seconds, we'll switch. Here we go. So 15 seconds, one side, 15 seconds, the other side. Bam, bam, come on. Let's go. Switch it up. Come on. This is too tough? Drop down to the elbows and try it that way. If that's still too tough, drop down on your knees and do it like this. There we go. All right, going back into it. Be leg lifts. Got the sweat pouring out the forehead. Here we go. Be leg lifts coming up. So feet out, coming up, back down, up the opposite side. Come on. Don't forget to breathe. Let's go. Here we go, levitation crunches. You're doing great. Keep pushing, keep going, don't give up. Even if you have to take breaks, just don't quit. Here we go. So coming straight up and back down. Coming up, exhale. Squeeze the core, back down. Come on. There we go. Try to get that little hold there. The shoulder blades off the ground every rep. There we go. Bicycle crunches. Woo! Abs are on fire. Here we go. Hands behind the head. Oh. Here we go. Embrace that burn. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Here we go. All right, need the elbow, single leg. Here we go, last one, and we're done. Couple seconds. All right, just one side, bam, bam. Come on, let's go, let's go. Keep pushing. Switch sides. Come on, let's go. Squeeze, squeeze. Woo, there we go. All right, we are done. My abs are on fire. No joke. Great workout today. Oh. Hope you guys enjoyed that workout. If you did, be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and we'll see you tomorrow. See you guys.